you know, Janet. <laughs> would you like your would you like your reserved seats down here? You're good right there. Okay, well that's respect. Yeah. It's not insulting at all. But that's <laughs> Would you like us to move your sign to back there? We can do that. There's signs on the seat. It says reserved. So let me take the signs back. Yeah. <laughs> Anybody, uh, how many of you went out, uh, got off the ship and went out to Nassau? How many of you just sat like a lump and barely budged from there? How many of you sat like a lump in Nassau? Yeah. How many, yeah, how many stayed in the boat but did a whole bunch of stuff? Okay, yeah. There are many ways, there are many ways to cruise. I myself, I'm Team Lump. Also, also I had two lunches. <laughs> that counts as stuff, right? I did a lot of stuff. I did a lunch and then I didn't have a lunch. Well, uh, double lunch, actually. Double lunch. Uh, Storm, what'd you do today? Uh, but I have way between lump and do. I was kind of a lump dude today. Between lump and better, do. Better than being a storm. <laughs> better than being a do lump. I know that. No, 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 that's not my way. No. <laughs> These do lumpers. <laughs> Just not my way. I have no idea what words are coming out of my mouth at this point. It's already, it's only Sunday. <laughs> We've been at sea for 16 weeks. We have. <laughs> uh, but it is time for morning announcements. Good evening, students. Good evening, Okay, I'm going to read several that have been pre-written for me and I have only sort of barely read, so I hope there's no swear words. Um, <laughs> that's really more of a red team vibe, to be honest. I'm not, I, oh, no, man, I'm starting oh. the rivalry. <laughs> I'm not saying it's good or bad. I just said they, they're the ones who cheer for the cussing. Um, you may sign up for the Bananagrams tournament that the, uh, our game, gaming team have put together, and the Murder Mystery Party. There's sign-ups for that in the game library, which is in the upper uh, main dining room on deck three of the ship. Also, there is a ship-wide chess match going on in the atrium, red team versus gold team, and the rule of it is, uh, as a participant on either side, you may only make one move per day. So it's an honor system thing, but you can move a thing, and then it's the other. You know, there are on the chess board. On the yeah, chess board, like, you can still move. Yeah, like more than one person can make a move in a day. Just you personally can only make a move a day. Are they so to finish the game. Yeah, no, it's, it's not like it's not like there's one move at all per day. It's just if you are participating, you make a move. Somebody else from the other team makes a move. Then somebody else from your team can make a move. It's person. It's a collaborative. Yeah, like the words I just said. Each person can only move a day. I don't listen to you. We have been at sea for 16 weeks. Uh, uh, as noted, um, we have had, we had to postpone the uh, Coach Cruz's anti-gravity derby that will be getting rescheduled. Oh. Now it's tied you over. Just drop some paper from your bed and <laughs> practice. <laughs> That's right. Uh, we also are going to have to reschedule the silent disco party this evening. You can. Uh, well, I'll be making an announcement about it once it has been rescheduled. It'll also be updated in all of the various online and printed schedules. It will be a silent announcement. <laughs> uh, as far as the Shadow Cruise events, uh, again, because for those of you who may have missed the announcements earlier, we are expected to have some kind of rough seas this evening. Those of you who remember uh, the, the dreaded first night concert of 2020. Some of us do. It's not going to apparently be that bad, but it could be rougher than we're used to. Uh, so if you are running a Shadow Cruise event this evening, and it is the discretion of the person in charge of the event as to whether you decide to keep it going or, or try to postpone it, uh, you can let us know. We can do everything we can to try and postpone it. We can't promise just because depending on space availability, but we'll do what we can. But that's your choice. The and Jenga tournament is not canceled with the <laughs> level of difficulty. Will be much higher. We're going to make a giant Jenga just to make it more fun. <laughs> Please do not get crushed under the giant jacket. <laughs> um, as a, a, a couple of main dining room reminders. Uh, first of all, uh, they need to clear the main dining room starting at 3 p.m. each day to set things up for dinner service. So we ask that you please 
politely comply uh, at 3 p.m. if you're gaming in there to wrap things up. And then once they have finished clearing the final dinner service, usually around 10 p.m., it opens up for gaming again. Also, uh, if you can, on uh, uh, during, during the week, uh, people have been showing up at times other than the standard 5 and 8.30, uh, 5 and 7.30 times. Uh, if you could show up at or near your assigned dinner time if you're going to the main dining room because showing up at the other one or in the middle can throw off uh, the way they have dinner service planned. The one exception to that, of course, is Thursday. That's the one day that has any time dining because of, uh, not, not Thursday, I'm sorry, Tuesday. The day we're in St. Croix. Time has lost all meaning, but the day we're in St. Croix, that is a day where you can kind of show up any time between uh, 5.30 and 9.30. But again, try to show up roughly when your, your scheduled dining time is, just so they can keep the, the dinner service efficient. Thank you. Um, let's see. Uh, the games will be getting secured for tonight's boatiness and tomorrow's boatiness, but you can still feel free to check them out. There's plenty of other places to game, uh, even if you want to game during dinner service. There's all sorts of tables all over the ship. They, they have, in fact, been secured, but if you're near the game library, might not want to linger. Don't sit. Too don't, long don't, don't play a game under the, the no. shelves of several hundred pounds of games. Not recommended. But they are they're, they're secured down by some orange uh, ratchet straps. But don't be intimidated by the straps. They're, they're everything is still open and for use. Please do not be intimidated by the straps. <laughs> that old song. Do not fear the swinging sword over your head. <laughs> time for every time I heard that. Okay, a couple more things. Uh, there's a service called Luggage Direct. Uh, which for a fee, you can, I, I, I hate to talk about disembarking already, but it's important. Uh, for a fee, you can have, the, you can set your bag, you, you sign up for this and you set your bags outside of your room on the final night before we depart, and they will take your bags and they will get taken all the way to the airport and checked onto your flight. You don't have to drag your checked luggage with you. It is optional, you don't have to do it. Many people take advantage of it. The reason we mention it is you should have received, or very, very soon will receive the paperwork for that. Uh, look for the thing that says, talks about Luggage Direct and follow the deadlines on that very carefully. We have no power to get you sort of snuck into the program once the deadline is passed. Uh, so if you're interested in that, make sure you read that and pay attention and sign up if you are so interested. Uh, specialty dining. Specialty dining is still available uh, at most of the venues. You can go to any of the venues uh, directly to sign up if you are interested in that. Also, you can dial 88 from any phone. Uh, last night, Drew said 8-2. He was wrong, and as such, he has been banished from the morning announcements, as you can see. <laughs> cabin upgrades are also still available. If you have any interest in upgrading your cabin, you can go to the ship services desk on one in the atrium. They can let you know what is available and what sort of uh, uh, rates you'd be talking about. So that is also an option. Uh, let's see, some more schedule stuff. Uh, because Ty Frank was uh, unfortunately unable to join us this week, the, uh, they want to make a TV show of my stuff panel scheduled for Wednesday with him and John Scalzi has been canceled. But at the same, now at the same time, which I believe is Wednesday at 11 o'clock, there will be uh, John Scalzi office hours at the Pinnacle Bar. Uh, let's see. Oh, also, this is uh, this is a good, important one. We are going to be scheduling a second bar crawl because the first one was very popular. So, watch out for that information. Finally, uh, as a reminder, tomorrow's theme is cosplay day. So, looking forward to that. Again, it's not required, but you are welcome and been encouraged to engage in uh, as much or as little cosplay as you choose. Tomorrow's theme is themes. <laughs> See how many themes you can spot. And that concludes uh, the morning announcements for this evening. Are you all ready to enjoy a really awesome concert? Yeah! Out of curiosity, um, she'll be coming up a little later. How many of you have never heard of or seen or heard anything by Dessa? You all are in for a particular treat. Those of us who know, know we're going to see a great show tonight. Those of you who don't know, get to be surprised with how great a show it's going to be. Uh, but out on this stage first, uh, this stand-up coming out, uh, this is a, a, a true story. Uh, I'm in charge of the programming, so I, I get to ask a lot of people, who should we book? And you all make a lot of suggestions. Who should we book for an upcoming cruise? And I asked three or four stand-ups that we know, uh, several of whom were on the cruise, several of whom weren't, just to recommend some people 
to uh, who we might should who would be great on the cruise who should we book uh, and this next performer was on every single one of those persons lists uh, we're really looking forward to have her join us she has been on Comedy Central and on HBO please welcome to the stage Shalewa Sharp shows for the artists who have merchandise for sale on board. Uh, their merchandise will be available up in the back on uh, deck two. This evening, Dessa's got some merch, uh, as well as, of course, for sale in the shops whenever the shops are open. So please feel free to peruse uh, those things. The second one is more intended for the people who are watching this right now, either simulcast in BB Kings or in your state rooms or watching it later on in the future. First of all, hi there. Everybody wave at the future, I guess. The camera's up there. It's up. I don't think they can even see you, but I just wanted to see if you'd do it. Um, we brought, uh, we, we knew a lot of people would be interested in, in the option of watching this thing from your, from your cat state rooms. And uh, so we, we had brought, we have like a three camera shoot going on for all the events happening in this room. When the ship was backing out of the pier today, there was a power surge and it fried their TV switcher. I know, like it actually smelled like fries and not the good fries. Uh, so we apologize right now, we're back down to basically just sort of a one camera thing. Uh, but hopefully the audio is still good. We're, you know, we're trying to improve that experience as well. Uh, but we want to, you know, you might have noticed if you're watching last night's show and all of these cool edits and stuff happening, and now it's just me in the middle of a big stage. Uh, so we apologize for that. Uh, but what are you going to do? Technology, am I right? <laughs> With all of that being said, uh, we, uh, Paul and Storm, we, I think Storm's over there somewhere. <laughs> that was either Storm or a person with really good comic timing who's not Storm. Um, and, uh, uh, nope, too late. See, that's why I know that's not Storm. Um, we met Dessa at an event thrown by Hank and John Green called NerdCon Stories some years ago. Had not heard of her and we're utterly blown away. It has taken us far too long to finally get her on the ship with us. But we did it, finally. I don't know who's to blame, certainly not the person in charge of scheduling things. Um, she's a singer, she is a writer, she is cool and awesome, and I'm very, very excited to say please welcome to the stage, Dessa. Thank you. 
I'm a big fan of transparency. I think it's important in art and all relationships. There's going to be a lot of aggressive rap in this show. It's bright enough that I can see you, and I'm mad if you leave. Here we go. Two bars 
why I get to a joke. First is a gold bar, then a soul. Yo, let me get the punchline. I'm with my old ghost says, with a glass too full to toast. It's so, thanks to work for real long, leaves close. And it wants to go boast with the brakes to the boat, the credit, and that's nothing that the blood water is coming in. Let's see you look. Look for unintended consequences. As those you can't see, the initials of your girlfriend kill the fucking oak tree. Nothing in my pockets but the body heat. Travel light, mind your manners. That's my horror talk. The Netflix cheat, see the pieces on the ceiling. Strategy of both, and the woods are competing. I am right by lightning bolt. Lead by cannonball. The China's fighting, and the bulls were cannibal. Before we continue this conversation, I just want to make sure that none of you are robots. So here, which one of these pictures has buses in it? <laughs> robots will never be able to figure out buses. <laughs> a base hit is the son of a bitch. A tanning bed is the son of the rich. A son of keeping up with the front of the fist. Don't go broke, look at a son of a bitch. A base hit is the son of a bitch. A tanning bed is the son of the rich. Keep your knuckles up for the fist. Don't go wrong with the sun. Critics, what did you do? I was not the professional that I hoped to be every day because my ass forgot the Twizzlers in LA. And I put a call on Twitter. And my girl Bridget met me on some weirdo red number five drug deal, right? Right outside the door. And we got Twizzle Hearts. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. That's what you Take your front step to be talking with me. No VIP says VIP. I know powerful women, beautiful men, and none of the powerful body standards that are nice and big. I'm a man to make a friend, motherfucker. Where you been? How you doing? What's the drink? It's cash and only one of the staff knows me. Tell them it's the girl in the back tabs open.
church, high the church, across the world. We still want to do a mission. We all make it to do this. Do your dream, friend. I got my chick pants and hurts. today to do a song called Good Grief Unplugged. And I'm going to get a stool because I always wanted to do that.
this. Just show me what it did. I'm ready to hurt for this. I know exactly what this is.
about drowning at sea. <laughs> My apologies retroactively for that film. Half 
for the way, trying not to stay wherever I came. You forgot the comment, forgot the moment, we're on your way. There's gotta be a better way to work today. Your mother, you told me, had been a great beauty and suffered profoundly the loss of us. You've been a practice of just expression of silent and mind from a book sanctions book. The father and his youth set off with the kind of the leader of one. Man's eternal the high of the sky and the brick of one who loved No ribbons, no starting guns, sprinting around the sun. Man's great little rage. The heathen contenders, they're bumping to say it's always the same. That's what everything happens just once And not times like ours I'm hopeless for shining Not much for stargazing We couldn't bear all of those We were as friends This was our first This was our only This was our very last chance
big science nerd, and that doesn't always work. Out. <laughs> I'm wasting my time for music, right? I'm a big science nerd, and that doesn't always mix effortlessly with a concert, so I feel like I have to take advantage of it now. These are just some, these are just some fun facts, just some fun facts, some science facts. Did you know, this, this is about like natural sciences, which I meant. Did you know that tomatoes aren't actually vegetables? They're microaggressions. Did you know that if you squish a lightning bug on your finger, its closest male relatives will return to avenge him. <laughs> that even before the Chinese invented paper, wasps were making it. But before that, Christopher Columbus invented wasps. <laughs> Don't be shy! I already like you, don't care what you drive, I'm attracted to the IQ. Is that my style to make the first one? Having all this type of ways is gonna be hard to go. See you in the kiss, try and let it be pissed. Yeah, it's all there is to pick if you wanna make a mind. You wanna make a friend, you can live a little larger. Just so the dividends. Real fast, let's go. I already missed too much to take this thing too slow. Stay tuned. 
something or talk to strangers. Look too long, go too far, I don't rage cause angels can't watch everybody all the time. Stay close, stay slow, stay fit time. The formula works if you can live it. But it works if I put half the world off limits. Yeah. <laughs>